Hi everyone. I came on a few minutes early to get the ball rolling. Um, and this is a beautiful transmission from Ascended Master Maitreya Buddha. Um, this is from March 30th. I, I was a little behind. So here I am today getting them all out. Um, and uh, I will begin transmission. Yes, beloveds, I have a message for you. Please follow your guide's promptings that you are receiving now. It may be an awareness of a thought voice or a ran random synchronicities that you notice. Follow the breadcrumbs because it will lead you to your next step in evolution of consciousness. Around every corner is a powerful activation and acceleration waiting for you. We are here on the planet and we are assisting all, all of humanity to know themselves more fully. So you are on a journey of true self-discovery, are you not? So each day, as each day passes, allow yourselves to let in new perspectives of life and your place in it. You are not the illusionary drama. You are not the stories. You are not the news and things that you see or, and things that are said to stir the populace. You are simply bliss in human form, for that is what divine source is. This bliss of who you are resides in your heart, also anchored in every cell of your bodies. This is your true state, pure bliss. This is what has been described by those who have been meditating and communicating. Oh, I am communing. I'm sorry. This is what has been described by those who have been meditating and communing with their God source. This bliss has been experienced when those of you have had near death experiences. Those who have come back into the human vessel tell of a feeling of overwhelming love that envelops them. This is the bliss of your divine nature. Within this bliss is the answer to who you really are, beloveds. As you, you are ready to understand the experience of this bliss in your hearts, the breath of peace between the breaths that I gave you in an earlier transmission is a key to opening this bliss within your hearts. At first, it may feel like a muscle that needs to be stretched out. It may feel like a yawn that you can't fully release or the muscles that you can't release in a stretch all the way at the top of that stretch. Some of the muscle release and there where you are at the top of a stretch you will feel this feeling of a sparkle something stirring in the top of your heart still you can feel that you have not reached the top of the bliss yet but do not worry beloveds this bliss is like a flower opening it will unfold more and more as you do practice the breath of peace between the breaths. And my beloveds, this is bliss. It begins to grow and you start to feel it enveloping you and going out to everything and everyone in the universe. It is going to bring tears of joy to your eyes when you feel this radiant bliss. This is an expansion into your vessel of who you really are. This will bring you to a more fully expressed blissful state while upon earth. So, therefore, you will be expressing yourselves as your God source upon earth. For this state of bliss is your true nature of unconditional love of everything and everyone. All that is in infinity. So, 
Be well, my loveds. I am Maitreya sending you total bliss. Please anchor it into your hearts. Until next time, beloveds, I bid you goodbye. End of transmission. So that was the short and sweet message from Maitreya talking about bliss and that we are bliss. That is that sense when you hear people who have NDEs, near-death experiences, they always come back saying they never wanted to leave because that overwhelming sense of unbelievable love is that ecstasy that you you feel even in meditation sometimes you can get to that point of samadhi you get to that point where you feel that um effervescent joy that is beyond all understanding and that connectedness with everything and that is who we are so you can understand in earth language we say oh oneness and love love everyone you know that is our state it's even beyond that so the blissful nature of who we are is just we can't put it in earth language, but we, we are these amazing, amazing beings. And the breath is a key to unlock that bliss starting in your heart. So Maitreya is pointing us back to that and explaining again how important that can be for feeling that overwhelming bliss in your heart. And I, I know because I've been experiencing it. It's tremendous. Um, oh, warrior girl, thank you. Lori, Sherry, thank you guys for being here. Um, oh, big hug to you, warrior girl, and to everyone. Thank you so much for being here, and um, thank you for listening to these messages. And the next message is scheduled for 145, but you know, I am just going to pop right into the next video. I'm not going to wait. I'm going to go ahead and do it. So uh, it's 125 my time instead of 145 when I said I was going to do it. So if, you know, 10, 20 minutes earlier. <laughs> but anyway, it's flowing. So I want to thank you guys so much. I love your energy. Thank you for being here. Hi, Lisa. Thank you for being here, and um, we'll see you on the next video, which is the second one from the Keepers of the Light Codes, which they are amazing beings. I can't wait to read it, because you know I channel, and I don't know what they said, and I always have to go back, and I'm typing it going, wow. <laughs> uh, namaste, warrior girl. Uh, we'll see you on, catch you on the next one, you guys. Mwah! Big hug and kiss out there to everyone. Um, and I'll see you.